Thanks for joining us. I'm Brianna Pitts with the WBZ News Update. Our top stories. The big July 4th Boston Pops fireworks spectacular is tonight. And if you're one of the thousands heading to the show, officials are urging you to take public transportation, stay hydrated, and stay vigilant. Old Ironsides will tour Boston Harbor today. Starting at 10 a.m., the USS Constitution will set sail for Fort Independence on Castle Island. It'll get two gun salutes, one there and then one outside of the Coast Guard station where the ship was built. Today's events commemorate the 242nd signing of the Declaration of Independence. An original copy of the Declaration is on display at the Commonwealth Museum in Boston. It's one of only 14 originals. Also on display, the letter George Washington wrote to Massachusetts leaders just days before the Declaration was ratified. The museum is on Columbia Point near the JFK Library. It is open and free today. Pretty cool. Barry Burbank is here with a check of the forecast. Barry, it's another hot one. Yeah, it is. The weather's not pretty cool. It's pretty hot. Continues hot, uh, Bri Brianna. It looks like mid to upper 90s inland. Probably not too many upper 90s like we had yesterday, but certainly low 90s to a few middle 90s. So it's a, we're ratcheting down a little bit. Probably inland temperatures about 5 degrees lower than yesterday. And coastal temperatures will be about as much as 10 degrees lower than they were yesterday. So there'll be a little bit of relief at the beaches where it was stifling hot and muggy yesterday. There is a little bit of a change today. Not much change on Cape Cod and the islands from what it's been the last few days. Uh, the National Weather Service, because of this heat, has a heat advisory up. Certainly stay hydrated and take it easy uh, for today and definitely tomorrow as well because it's going to be hot again. Cape and the islands will be in the 80s over the next f few days and it'll be Friday when the Cape gets its showers and storms Friday afternoon and Friday evening. For beach and boating for today, it uh, looks like 85 with an east-southeast breeze 5 to 15. High tide late this afternoon. And as far as thunderstorms are concerned, and it doesn't look like there's going to be any around the Esplanade and points west and north from there. So it'll be about 88 at 2 p.m., 83 around 6 p.m., and about 80 at the Esplanade around 10 p.m. So the thunderstorms, the natural fireworks won't be nearby. They'll be farther down in Connecticut and Rhode Island today. But there'll be a few scattered ones around tomorrow afternoon, and almost everybody will get showers and storms on Friday. So therefore, it'll be cooler, but still very muggy. And then it dries out the weekend. It's looking fabulous. So good, so good this weekend. Brianna? I'm looking forward to cooler temperatures, Barry. Thank you. I'm Brianna Pitts. This has been a WBZ News Update.